Hello, everyone. This is Jarvis S. Scott with What's Happening in Birmingham. Today, I have the honor and pleasure. I'm back again with some of the great people at all of us at UAB. Dr. James Semino, he is the co one of the co-investigators. He is also the inaugural director of the Informatics Institute at UAB and Professor of Medicine. Dr. Semino, welcome on podcast today. Uh, thank you, Jarvis. Good to be here. Great, great, great. So I wanted to bring him on because he has a unique um, role with the All of Us program here. So before we start, can you give the audience kind of like a very impressive bio for a quick little introduction about yourself? Sure. I am uh, I uh, trained in inf um, internal medicine in New York City. Uh, and after my uh, residency in medicine, I did a fellowship in biomedical informatics at Harvard uh, Massachusetts General Hospital then went to uh, Columbia University, where I was in, in on the Faculty of Medicine and Biomedical Informatics for 20 years. Uh, I then went to NIH for seven years, where I was working at the National uh, Institute of Health Clinical Center to build a repository of uh, research and clinical data for used for research. And then after seven years, I came here to UAB. I've been here now eight years, uh, where I uh, practice medicine, teach informatics, uh, and uh, do biomedical informatics research. Okay, so let's just start with, the, I guess, the first question after that. So what is the UAB All of Us Research Program? Well, well so we are, we are part of uh, the larger All of Us Consortium. Uh, UAB is the lead institution for the Southern, the Southern Consortium. And we have two roles. One is that we're leading a group of health uh, provider organizations who are doing recruitment. And we are ourselves a health provider institution, the biggest one in the in the consortium uh, okay we, so we're you know and what we do is we're recruiting patients to be part of the million uh member cohort for this this large uh federal research project we're not doing any actual research uh ourselves in this it's really the recruitment part uh and providing data from um from electronic health records for the uh the overall uh all of us consortium so in your opinion, what makes this research start? Because I know you worked on plenty in your, in your career different from the other ones you worked on. So, yeah, well, uh, because first of all, I'm doing a lot of recruitment uh, or we're okay. part of it. You know, I don't do the recruitment myself, but um, the research projects I've worked on have mostly been with small groups of physicians, usually sometimes patients, sometimes nurses uh, who are testing out systems that we're, we're building here, we're uh, identifying a large number of people, some, you know, 20, 30,000 people now, I think we have in our consortium uh, here, and we're providing data from the electronic health record. And we have to extract the data, uh, turn it into the correct format, get it transmitted to the, the, uh, the um, data resource center and make sure the data are correct, that we're not sending the wrong data, uh, and then we're sending everything that we can send to uh, to fill out the the, uh, the uh, research record uh, at the DRC. Do you know what's happening in Birmingham? Download the What's Happening Birmingham app today on Android, iPhone, and iPad for free. Get info on everything you need to know about local news, events, businesses, restaurants, and more. Visit our website, whatshappeningbham.com, or follow us on social media at Happening Beham for more information. Download the What's Happening Birmingham app today, your source for everything Birmingham.